as you can probably tell by the cartoons in the background, it's Hollywood Studios Day today. Our first time going to Hollywood Studios on this trip. Um, some of you will be aware, Hollywood Studios probably now has the, some of the best rides in Disney. Hopefully gonna get on Rise of the Resistance for the first time. We've got two DAS advanced selections for Millennium Falcon Smugglers Run and Slinky Dog Dash. I've seen Toy Story Land before, which is really good. Uh, Jenny hasn't, she's really excited for that. But neither of us have ever seen Galaxy's Edge, so it's gonna be brand new going to Batuu for the two of us today. Um, wearing my Mickey t-shirt here today, which I actually bought in Hollywood Studios uh, back in 2019. I've also got my Star Wars lounge fly, which I'm sure you'll um, see in a bit too. Um, but yeah, just got the Mickey cartoons because obviously Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway is also there, um, kind of in the center hub of the park. Uh, I bought Genie Plus today as well. I did, I could get a time for Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway, but it clashed with Smuggler's Run that we've got obviously booked. And also we've got a reservation at Ogre's Cantina at around quarter past one. So didn't really all click together, unfortunately, but hopefully later in the day, once we've used our Genie Plus or the two hours have elapsed or whatever, I'll be able to get Mickey and Minnie on Genie Plus too, get return time for Rise of the Resistance with DAS. And yeah, hopefully we'll get a lot done. We both love shows as well. So there's obviously a few shows in Hollywood Studios. You've got the Frozen Ever After one I've never done. Beauty and the Beast is always good, Indiana Jones. Um, quite a few character meet and greets there too. And also, uh, what else have we got? Oh yeah, we've also got, I think in the evening, the kind of uh, projection show thing. I don't know what that's gonna be like. I don't know if it's just a minor thing or if, or if that would be quite cool as well. So yeah, we've got a lot to look forward to. Really enjoying our room in Coronado here. It's a bit of a mess at the moment, but we had a really good day at the resort. We went to um, Via del Lago or Three Bridges for dinner last night. Absolutely amazing, with the exception of the obvious meal at California Grill. I think that was my favorite meal so far. Um, food was really good. Our server, Jamie, she was lovely, really friendly, and actually got us some uh, complimentary uh, bubbles at the end of the meal give, uh, because we were wearing our celebration badges. Um, so yeah, absolutely, you know, really, really high quality meal. Got some good views of Grand Destino Tower as well. Picked up a Coronado pin. Spent most of the day by the pool. Um, firstly by our like, mini local pool and then at the dig site, which was really good fun. Went down the slide, it was a little nippy slide for a resort slide actually. And uh, yeah, and this morning, in the morning we were at Target, obviously buying some stuff and we went over to Springs and tried chicken guy. So we had a really good day yesterday, nice chilled one. Um, both got some blisters on our feet, which we're trying to attend to this morning um, before it's gonna be quite a busy day in Hollywood Studios, just cause there's so much to do there and you don't wanna miss out. So we're excited and uh, yeah, we're off to Hollywood Studios.
we're in Batu. We've just done Rise of the Resistance. I want to go and do it again straight away. That, that was, was amazing. So immersive. That was I don't so know cool. how they do some of the stuff they do. We escaped the first order. We did escape. It was close, but we did make it. But we're absolutely blown away by Batu, and that was incredible. Yeah. By far the most immersive experience I've Completely ever had. Completely worth the wait. And like, we avoided all the YouTube videos, we avoided any kind of spoilers of the ride. And I'm so glad we did. Definitely. That was amazing. Oh, incredible. Yeah. Blown away. Yeah. I've been really looking forward to this one. I have. During your slow moving journey. During your 
So as you can probably tell, we're in Epcot today. We've just done Spaceship Earth, yeah, your first really ever good. time, which yeah, is really good fun. It. I've got how good that is. I'm so glad uh, I managed to go on it. Probably get to go on it a couple more times before the end of the trip too. Uh, we've got Soarin' and Test Track coming up, Frozen coming up, the DAS, and we've got dinner at the Cellier, so... Very excited. Join us along on our Epcot day. day. Woohoo! Okay, so we're going to deduction for the lack of edible flour. Yeah, I'd agree, really tasty. That was like the uh, enchilada mole negro, something like that. Um, got a little sweet sauce kind of with it, and it's very spicy, but good views as well. I'd say four out of five as well.